Poppy Bleed from Chapter 3 just got a ton of updates with the newest ARG being solved, kind of. A new full ARG starting soon. A brand new teaser we're gonna be breaking down today, along with some controversy and so much more. Like the video if you're looking forward to Chapter 3, but let's just get into it. So basically, picking up from where we left off, if you don't remember, in my last video, we were given our very first teaser for what appears to be Chapter 3, outside of the original teaser, of course, judged by the big three hiding inside of it when looking at it. And we also see this random mysterious character here who I've theorized before as being Huggy Wuggy. However, as a side note, other people have pointed out that the character actually looks more like a bird figure, which would fit with an older theory I made on this channel that suggested the Chapter 3 main antagonist was a vulture. Or better yet, some even noticed that if you fully flip the image, it makes out the silhouette of Bron too. So this tease seems to be very interesting. However, you might remember that after this new teaser was released, a developer sent us this piece of Morse code on their Discord server that when translated led to a google drive link that because of how morse code work was all stuck in caps and if you've ever seen a google drive id or even the youtube link above this video they use both uppercase and lowercase lettering so when searching up the google drive link it just errored out however that was pretty much where my last video ended and that was over four days ago at this point so what happened well following this message we were given a set of ones and zeros on the discord server that appear to be some sort of binary cipher however when translating the code through different online websites we would get nothing really conclusive however following this we would get another clue from the developers that reads up is one down is zero which led people to theorize that if we have the ones and zeros from the previous message they could represent that the ones are for capital letters in the url and the zeros are for lowercase so when applying it to the google drive id being these numbers here we get this combination however there aren't enough numbers shown here to finish the id and so as time passed and people started guessing the developers would give us two more messages one with two zeros suggesting the combination had two more lowercase numbers and one more cryptic greek message that roughly translated on google translate to the number zero adding another lowercase but that still left us with multiple letters at the end with no answer and the only way to figure out the combination from this point forward was to literally just guess and simply just try different combinations over and over again until somebody brute forced it and found out that it was this combination of numbers and letters that by the way aren't even the same capitals that we solved for the puzzle for some reason which when entering into your browser would allow you to download a brand new file simply called 3.rar and as you could probably expect whenever you downloaded this file it was of course locked by a password and this is where things would start to get complicated because for starters this new file began to start a lot of controversy around the community since if you were to try and download the file there was actually a chance that your computer would flag it as a virus and would not let you download it which was leading to a lot of people thinking that this whole ARG was some sort of scam or that somebody was posting virus links to try and take advantage of the whole situation but on the bright side at least the devs clarified that this was in fact not a virus and was just marked as one incorrectly however going back to the password with literally no clues how in the world were we supposed to figure this one out well to be honest this might be the craziest most confusing puzzle of all time as one of the developers on the team had their spotify account connected to their discord and over time if you looked at the spotify account three songs would play one called seeing eyes another called cctv and one more called cam i believe and when combining these phrases into one you get the words seeing eyes cctv cam which then literally just by guessing or solving some sort of puzzle i guess you're supposed to replace the letter e's with threes and the eyes with ones which gives us this new combination and when entering this string of words into the puzzle it would solve and give us a brand new couple of files to work with one being a .txt file that simply said 333 eyes 111 i seeing and an edited version of the original teaser we got that shows these same words painted over top it now to put it simply this puzzle that we were given wasn't actually ever solved and it's actually because this arg never really existed and was rather simply a bonus or a pre-arg which was meant to tease chapter 3 in the meantime which there's actually a big update on later in this video so stick around but with this newest puzzle the only reason we solved this is because the developers ended up just sharing the puzzle over time as fans got very frustrated with never being able to figure it out however to simplify basically the actual context behind this mini ARG if you can call it that was that according to the developers originally when Poppy Playtime chapter 1 had its remaster released on June 20th you might have remembered that the trailer hinted at new lore secrets 
secrets being the game with them talking about all the features coming in the new update along with them saying and more at the end of it however when playing the new remaster people were quick to point out that there wasn't actually anything hiding in this chapter at all but the reason for this is because originally the chapter one remaster was supposed to actually have a hidden new room inside of it one that was going to be completely new to the game and was going to have a code lock or some form of encryption of entering a password into it to where then after solving this mini ARG we spent the past few days doing we would get this piece of text shown earlier that could then be entered into chapter one's hidden room to unlock some type of secret that to this day still hasn't been revealed to us I personally think that this was originally meant to be the start of the ARG and chapter one's update was going to be the first start of the chapter three ARG however for whatever reason whether it be time constraints or something in that nature this ARG was scrapped and for even more confusing reasons they still decided to half release it to us though it never worked and this ARG was just a bonus for fans however this actually ended up backfiring completely as you could expect since hearing that this wasn't even a real ARG along with how frustratingly difficult it was to solve made a ton of people angry as the ARG at least for me consisted of days upon days of sitting on discord and the games digging through every single possible secret with no clues or hints on where to go just to find out that this was basically all for nothing the thing that sucked about this though is that people in the discord began to get really angry and started attacking the developers causing them to even have to close some of their chats temporarily which just isn't very mature but at least moving on into some good news following this crazy bit of controversy the developers would end up making an official statement saying hey everyone i'm glad to see you all theorizing over the latest teaser from tuesday it's been very interesting for us to watch in relation i wanted to let you all know about a compressed folder that is currently circulating under the label 0.3 rar i want to clarify that this file is not related to the upcoming chapter 3 arg nor any other official poppy playtime promotion the chapter 3 arg has not yet begun but when it does you will know what trust me and below we see ourselves a brand new teaser which also looks insane so starting with breaking down the message itself this is actually a crazy response because it actually tells us that while the last ARG was a bit of a mini test run there is in fact going to be another poppy playtime ARG for chapter 3 separately coming at least at some point soon and they reassured us that we will know when it starts whatever that means but what's the most important part about this entire thing is that we were given this extra little teaser here at the bottom which actually tells us a lot about the ARG because for starters we could see that it's the same monitor that we saw from the first teaser however this time it appears to be activated showing us a cctv network page of some sorts as if this is going to end up being interactable with arrows that we can use to swap to different viewpoints however one of the most important things about this page is the camera view that we see below it as this would be the exact same cctv camera view that would periodically show up when teasing chapter 2 originally for that arg on the security.poppyplaytime website which we've theorized was going to reactivate at some point soon and to me this seems like confirmation that it's once again going to go live and possibly similar to something like security breach tv we may even be able to interact with this on the website itself furthermore another thing i wanted to point out while maybe a stretch is that the cctv network ui design appears to be a mimic or redesign of the windows 95 version of computer software respectively released in 1995 and being replaced by windows xp in 2001 so if i'm accurate this would once again fit into the timeline that the arg in the events that happened in it were all at some point in the late 90s which funny enough is actually around the same time we theorized for project playtime itself to take place and recently in that game we were just given a currently unusable phone that we will supposedly need for later perhaps for say an ARG I mean it seems possible that these could all be connected in some deep twisted way and when the ARG does come out this could be one massive ARG stretching across multiple games and multiple storylines which if true would be insane but the last question question though regarding the ARG is when will it end up finally happening while we originally theorized that chapter 3 was going to drop at some point in mid-July judged by the new posters that we got in project playtime projecting something happening on July 15th plus the original teaser that seemed to tease the date July 19th however now as those dates get within just a couple weeks I'm beginning to wonder if those could actually be for when we're gonna get some sort of ARG clues of some sorts or maybe even the real start of the official ARG itself. I don't know, but soon we'll figure it out. Comment how many times I said ARG in the comments below. I'll pin the person who does it first. And if you're wanting more news on the ARG,
energy, check out this video here. Subscribe, guys, and peace out.